as we are going to celebrate the festival of holi everyone loves to celebrate the colors of joy but then a day before they also have dahan holika dahan and this comes from the past time in the 7th canto uti which means shubh ashubh ichha pralad maharaj represents shubh ichha hiranyakashipu represents ashubh ichha or inauspicious desire and what was his inauspicious desire he wanted to be the controller of the whole universe he wanted to have his false ego superimposed on everyone else to the extent that he could not tolerate his little son exclaiming and accepting lord vishnu as the supreme the entire universe accepted hiranyakashipu's supremacy only one boy his own son prahlad refused to accept that his ego hiranyakashipu's ego was so infatuated that it could not accept this and so in great anger he tried to kill prahlad by throwing him under elephants throwing him in a pit of snakes throwing him from the top of mountains throwing him inside an ocean and placing mountains on him and then one of the ways hiranyakashipu tried to kill prahlad was by calling hiranyakashipu's sister and prahlad maharaj's aunt holika who had been benedicted that she could never be burnt by fire and then she embraced prahlad but Prahlad's devotion to Vishnu was so powerful that although there was a raging fire in which Prahlad was sitting in the lap of Holika Holika got destroyed and Prahlad survived so therefore the festival of Holi when we burn this Holika dahan it is a representation of the fact that नहीं कल्याण कृत कश्चित दुर्गतिम तात गच्छति इफ वी आर ऑलवेज वॉकिंग ऑन द पाथ ऑफ ऑस्पिशियसनेस एंड धर्मा एंड ट्रुथ एंड रिमेंबर द सुप्रीम लॉर्ड इन ऑल सर्कमस्टेंसेस वी कैन वेरी इजिली पास थ्रू बैप्टिजम बाय फायर ट्रायल्स ऑफ फायर एंड कम आउट विक्टोरियस इन अवर लाइफ